Well, uh, Jacob Frankel is uh, still with me now. Jacob, I just want to touch on this issue of compensation because I was actually sitting in a session yesterday and this was something that was being discussed. Is there a little too much emphasis on this now and, and does it risk hurting potentially the competitiveness of the banking industry going forward? Well, in my judgment, what uh, threatens the competitiveness today is a lack of clarity in the regulatory front. You know, there have been a lot of legislations and the Frank Dodd legislation and the like. Uh, we at JP Morgan supported many of these measures. But at the end of the day, there are some issues that need to be addressed. We are in a global marketplace. Therefore, the level playing field principle must be maintained. Mm. And regulations that are imposed in the US on US banks, yeah. if they are not imposed in a similar way elsewhere, that's what may hurt the competitiveness. So it is in this regard that uh, that's a source of concern. Of course, the compensation mm. issue, uh, we are very much aware of it and uh, have been much before that. The issues of uh, uh, clawbacks and the issue of uh, uh, more stock-based compensation and things exactly. of that type. Yeah. So, and you know, JP Morgan, the, the reason why we have done relatively well in this crisis is because of the risk management. And part of the risk management is indeed mechanism and framework in which we always ask, and what if? And we are very careful of not overextending ourselves. Okay, so let me ask you then about taxes. I know that this is this is an issue that that you you know that is very much on your mind right now, particularly after President Barack Obama's State of the Union address proposing a potential 30% tax. I think it was on those earning upwards of a million dollars. I mean, do you think that is that the sort of thing? Uh, that you would be on board with? Is that sort of thing that uh, many people who are in that pay bra bracket would be comfortable with, or do you think it would actually end up hurting investment? Well, I think that the tax reform is always a serious issue to be undertaken as a component of a very broad macro and microeconomic policy package. Uh, my uh, impression of the excessive focus on let's tax the rich is that uh, there may be there some uh, uh, populistic uh, uh, motives because the real issue is how do you resume sustainable growth and promote employment? And it's difficult for me to see how this can be a major pillar in promoting employment. After all, it is the business sector that does the hiring. And if you are going to start taxing the business sector, you will hurt the expansion plans. And I repeat again, clarity about the policy stance is key because investors and entrepreneurs yeah. need clarity well, in order to hire and Jacob invest. Jacob Frankel, Chairman of JP Morgan International, thank you so much for joining us.